As we get closer to Thanksgiving Thursday, most of you are already buying and getting that food ready for the big day. Five News reporter Rachel Williams shares advice on how to deep fry a turkey safely. Deep frying a turkey can be delicious, but it can be dangerous if not done correctly. The Springdale Fire Department says there are important things to remember before dropping the bird into the hot oil. It's that time again, time for our favorite holiday dishes and gathering around the dinner table. Here in the South, deep frying a turkey is a popular tradition, but it comes with a lot of risk. With Thanksgiving a few days away, the Springdale Fire Department says there is something you should do now. One thing you need to do, you need to be getting that turkey out now. If you're going to be doing, taking care of it on Thursday, you need to let the thing completely fall, fall out. Captain Pinkley says the next thing is don't put too much oil in the fryer. Follow the fryer's recommendations up to the fill line. Putting it into the oil, overfilling the oil, tipping it over. There's a lot of things that can happen. Even as far as you don't put the oil into the pot before you light it, you can, that, that aluminum pot, you can burn a hole into that pot. Now you've got oil dripping onto an open flames. There isn't a set distance on where to deep fry the turkey, but Captain Pinkley says at least 10 feet away from your home is a safe option, and it's best to have a fire extinguisher nearby. It's better to have it, not need it, than to need it, not have it. You have something go wrong with it, and then now you're trying to go find the extinguisher. Where did you put it? Where is it at? So, I mean, you need to make sure that you have all combustibles away. You make sure that you don't have kids, you don't have pets. You know, get off by yourself. Don't do it in the garage. Don't do it in the house. Don't do it next to the house. Get out in the middle of the yard. Make sure there's nothing around uh, to cook that turkey. Now, what happens if you don't follow these fire safety tips? You have open flame. And you have a big fireball, you have combustibles around, it can, uh, it can be very bad. When you're cooking the turkey, it should take about 45 minutes, and you need a certain tool to make sure it's done properly. Use that thermometer, make sure it's staying in at 350 degree range and not getting any hotter uh, than it should. But um, easing the turkey into it, it's like I said, it's a slow, methodical process. And finally, after you're done cooking, be sure to keep that area free from kids or pets. The oil still needs to cool down, and that could take a couple of hours. Rachel Williams, 5 News.